so today I'm going to be doing a guinea pig cage tour for September. This is going to be like the September cage tour, even though it's still August. Um, I'm just going to upload this now and it's going to count for September's cage tour. So um, I have two guinea pigs. I have Oliver and Smokey and they basically live together. Smokey doesn't live in there all the time. Sometimes I move Smokey out because the guinea pigs don't get along ideally. Um, I really would like to get a third guinea pig so that they kind of have like different things. I just feel like a third guinea pig would create like clicks. I don't want one to be left out all the time. So right now I just have two. I have Oliver, which is the brown and white one, and then I have Smokey, the gray and white one. So they have a 6x2 or 12 square foot CNC cage, and I got it for $120 on eBay. Um, it's a really, really nice cage. It's very durable. It's very big, and they have lots of space. It's four times, or I guess kind of two times as much space as they need. It's about three times as much space as they need. Um, so I'm just going to start over here. And by the way, I use fleece and towels in their cage. Um, so right here, I have the main water bottle, which is right here, and it's um, a Living World water bottle. I have their two food dishes with their pellets in there, and then I have this fleece here. Then I have all their toys. I have some chew toys and some this carrot thing and this loofah. And then I have some bedding right here. And I have this fleece and this blanket. Then I have the pig loo and Oliver is currently under there. Um, and then over here I have more bedding. Then back here, I this is the new additions. I have two um, kind of like litter trays, but they're almost... They're kind of like litter trays, but not quite like litter trays because, um, they are, I use them to put the hay inside. So what I did is I took two cereal boxes and I made two, one for each pig, but they kind of, Oliver being the dominant one, usually just takes his away. But I put bedding at the bottom and I put hay on top in both, and then I have the extra water bottle right here. So they like to eat and do their business in there. And if you guys want tutorials on the hay, hay room things, the litter box ones. If you want tutorials on those, I can do tutorials on those. And um, if you hear guinea pigs rumble strutting throughout this video, I'm sorry, my guinea pigs do not get along 100% yet. Um, I'm still trying to bond them together, and I thought making two of these would help so that maybe they won't fight, and two water bottles and two food dishes. I also, I'm about to prepare, prepare their veggies, so I'm gonna go get the two veggie dishes and put them in there. I give them celery and lettuce and sometimes carrots, um, and then sometimes I'll give them like asparagus or like certain vegetables and sometimes fruits. Fruits usually once a month or once every two weeks. But yeah, that's just the cage tour. If you want an updated hamster cage tour of Bear and Cheerios cages, um, I can do that. But thanks guys for watching and this has been my guinea pigs cage tour for September of 2015. Bye guys!